What's up everyone, welcome back to the Durbin Compound. If you haven't met me already, my name is Devin Durbin. So today, we've got Dylan's 7.3 Power Stroke back in the shop. Um, we had some brake issues. Well, I shouldn't say we, I mean you had some brake issues. So we're gonna get into tearing it down. Uh, we've already taken a little bit apart, so uh, stay tuned. All right guys, so uh, we've already figured out our issue. Uh, we don't know if a brake pad fell out. Dylan's kind of bummed about it. Uh, we don't know if a brake pad came out or it didn't get installed in the first place, but mis mistakes happen and I'm glad that we caught it. So the brakes were really squeaking really bad. Um, I'll roll in a clip right here as you can hear. Uh, they're squeaking like crazy as uh, Dylan pulled it in the shop. So I got some b-roll of it coming in the shop We took it apart and the inner brake pad was non-existent. So Unfortunately, we've got to make a trip to AutoZone to get some parts that Dylan wasn't expecting to so it basically trashed the caliper I'll roll in a picture of it here uh, it, it pretty much trashed both pistons and yeah, well, we got to go get a new caliper So you live and you learn you make mistakes and uh, you know, it didn't cost any uh, you know, nothing happened, so that's good. Um, I'm glad that, that, that nothing happened that was bad. So we're going to replace the brake caliper tonight, uh, the rotor, and the brake pads. We're actually going to install the, the brake pad again. Okay. I'm not blaming anybody. So we were both working on it. Who knows where the brake pad went because it's not around here. So uh, let's... It uh, fell out. It <laughs> fell out. <laughs> so we are headed to AutoZone. So let's, uh, let's take off. Let's get going. back from AutoZone so we got some chow while we're out uh, pizza and subs so uh, we are gonna get started on replacing this brake caliper and uh, maybe Jonathan from always up too late might uh, join us uh, sometime during the video if you ever text somebody back uh, but uh, we're gonna get down to it I think I'm gonna do a little time-lapse maybe maybe not I don't know maybe we'll BS but um, we are going to uh, try to get this thing bled down so nothing but good things I guess all right guys so I'm just supervising the project here <laughs> I'm not really doing much of nothing I'm holding down a stool um, while Dylan puts these calipers on um, we're gonna go ahead and put the calipers on get it bled down um, we're going to uh, I hope to do a video in the near future with an all tell um, uh, programmer or uh, diagnostic tool that allows you to bleed the brakes on these uh, ABS on these ABS modules on these uh, trucks so oh nice you got out the knee creeper or the knee dolly um, I hope you can see that in frame so Dylan uses my knee dolly more than I do but uh, it's it's definitely a lifesaver if you're it need to be moving around on your knees um, so I'll put a link to that in the description Those, that's a, a nice tool to have I think they're only like 20 bucks
guys, if you didn't see the video of the most useful tool in the shop, uh, one of the things that I uh, highlighted was my Snap-on Tech Angle Torque Wrench. So this is a half inch drive model. Um, I am about to torque the lug nuts onto the driver side. We're about to take off the passenger side to replace the pads over there. So after we're done with that, we'll take her for a spin, uh, get some sweet rolling footage of that, um, and then we'll wrap this video up. Huh. It was pretty good. He throws on a good show. I do get my hands dirty. All right guys, I hope that you guys loved that time lapse. I tried to roll it in, make it as good as possible. So in the near future, we'll be doing an update video on this F-250, Dylan's F-250. Um, I get my hands dirty a little bit, uh, but mostly it's him working on his own truck. I just provide the tools. So I hope, to, uh, I hope that in the future, we'll bring some great content with the truck and uh, we'll keep doing what we're doing. I hope you enjoyed the shop vlog. Um, if you like the content, please hit subscribe. I'm coming out with a video every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday at noon. Um, hope to see you around the channel, and as always, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down, whatever you're into, and we'll see you guys in the next video.